there is so many industry and I think we are going to evolve into different generation and I'm hoping it will happen soon and for example there are so many industry if you go out one of the industry is clothing industry there will be a time I'm hoping very soon that we would explore a clothes option in electronic uh, the design of the clothes or something electronic that we would evolve in that section in that sector actually and I think we would evolve in electronic clothing and uh, there will be design or something that we can function that electronic would be um, component of it would come through for the, for the the design of the clothes or the clothes itself if it would evolve and the next industry I think is makeup it's also a big industry that's actually functioning pretty well but there is not improve and they're not evolving i mean they're not looking at the lighting feature of makeup um they're not looking into the design um it's just one makeup for everybody and you know that uh, it's not it's not like specific feature specific feature for different people or doesn't even consider electronic component of it like for example you can create different like uh, lighting features and even the makeup itself can be evolved actually and it would be more like a uh, electronic gaming where now where you don't even put the makeup but the makeup is done using the light but it, it hasn't happened in the real world we can put and then next thing is here i guess uh, where we have to take that straightener out and to straighten the hair i mean we've been doing that for past 15 years but the hair itself is i mean it's a ionic discharge or and it would just create like a you have to now you brush your hair then you have to put some in a band electronic band it would just straighten it because the ionic discharge is traveling through the hair and it would straighten it or something like that but it hasn't happened yet either so what is our industry doing they're doing nothing for us And if you if you really think about it, the food that we take intake that uh, mainly the COVID is the result of uh, of not monitoring the way. I'm not saying the way we eat. We we've been very uh, looking after the fast food sector and say um, they could they're not providing enough nutrition. Um, also. There is not enough nutrition. The COVID was a result of vitamin and so many other deficiency. Instead of um, instead of the government looking after the people, I mean, we were looking through different means of energizing our body. Our our goal is to energize our body, get the rest 
energize our body is the result the food intake is to make sure that we have enough energy to function but these days we don't have enough energy right i mean they have explored yoga and meditation but is there i mean can we incorporate it into like where we have to sit down and do yoga and meditation can we incorporate that into our daily life and not just the goal of the food intake to energize our body but are we receiving enough energy from it all so is there Is there a program that's going to support our people? I mean, even in Canada, we are, I mean, mainly here, we don't have enough energy to function. People are dying. So, are they, is there going to be like, you know, where we as a people have more control of our health? our intake of our food that um, somebody making decision for us but is it possible that uh, they could have provided some kind of support system more efficient support system from the government like they could have I don't know like uh, this vitamin deficiency is the main result very very sad even in the first world country people dying from vitamin deficiency there's not enough vitamin in our body system to function you take a vitamin tablet and you see the big difference but is it available to us and um, it's just not the vitamin is it like tailored to support our system I mean, we have a general idea of the vitamin we have to take, but our goal is to energize our body. It doesn't say what kind of energy. We have an explored energy aspect of the food that we digest is churning into energy. And, and that energy that we need, we don't need the food, we need the energy.